When you're tired of being extremely broke in real life, grab a 9-iron and get balls deep in a sport that's pretty much exclusively for rich people. And live out your fantasies of playing golf with all your friends in the Mushroom Kingdom without the uncomfortable fact that country clubs had a no-toes policy until like 30 years ago. Mario Golf Super Rush Play the only series of golf games anyone actually cares about after they stopped making Tiger Woods and Hot Shots, where Nintendo will once again trick you into briefly caring about the sport by making it goofy, wacky, and most importantly, one million times easier than the actual game of golf, as you take control of one of Mario's many frenemies to participate in extremely friendly, low-stakes tournaments, where it's also legal to use magic and beat the sh** out of each other. And before you ask, no, it's somehow still not as good as the Game Boy Advance would. Blast through more holes than a sex addict in Super Rush's titular Rush Mode, where Nintendo thought they could jazz up the boring old golf game by making you walk between the holes, while your ass gets annihilated by Psycho Crushers from Country Club Wario, or that the sport of golf, a game that quickly gets frustrating when you screw up even a little bit, would be improved by giving everyone super shots that can blast your ball off the green and into the rough in a blue shell -esque game design that punishes you for not sucking and turns the usually dull game of golf into the PGA version of Death Race. I love this game. Check out Super Rush's other modes, like Speed Golf, where you ignore any sense of strategy and just whack away like a madman, or Battle Golf, where you do the exact same thing except in some kind of insane golf stadium where you compete over holes in no particular order while explosions go off everywhere like you're golfing in an active war zone, a mode that is probably the coolest thing this game has going for it initially but which still falls prey to the same flaw as the rest of Super Rush, that golf rewards patience and careful planning and actually gets less fun when you're trying to finish every hole in like a minute and a half. Forgive me for wanting golf to be relaxing and not feel like someone's banging on the stall door while I'm trying to take a shit. Check out Super Rush's most predictable disappointment, the story mode, where you'll slap together a me character because I guess we're still doing that? And set out on an extremely poorly fleshed out adventure that's barely more than a drawn out tutorial, where you'll raise your stats and buy new gear between rounds, then realize that it barely matters as you roll over all your opponents with ease, then do it again and again with slightly more holes each time or shoot the ball into a tornado to get it over a mountain because golf just wasn't annoying enough as it is. As the game makes absolutely sure that it's hammered home each of its modes, then reel in surprise as it suddenly drops weird magical powers and a series of actual cool boss fights, before ending abruptly and leaving you with nothing except a dumb looking me you'll never use again because you can pick actual Mario characters in a story mode where the only real story is the one that you're telling yourself about still enjoying this franchise and another chance to make a very stupid looking me in golf pants. His name is Lolf and he's doing his best. So grab your most powerful wedge and put on clothing that makes you look like you own a plantation for the reanimated corpse of a series of games that at one point felt like a good idea but now just feels like an obligation that's developed out of sheer habit. To be fair, there's still a perfectly serviceable normal golf game somewhere in there if you actually want that. But then you're probably also a 50-year-old who says, the YouTube. Starring Under Pario Over Pario not invited to the tournament, Big Club Playa, The Putting Princess, Driving Mrs. Daisy, Airbud, Full Swing, Bowser Fieri, Green Queen Pauline, Triple Boogie, and a football player, Mario's Hole in One. Okay, how are you going to make a golf game and not let us play as a character basically named Birdie? Tell us what you'd like to hear in my epic voice in the comments below. You're a lunatic with a madman's dream of a milk-proof robot. The SNES is the best NES of all the NESSes. Reading is hard. A great man doesn't seek to lead. He's called to it. Rudy Toot Toot, you're the king of the Wimbrawlers.